drink a glass of ice water before bed and take a weight loss supplement to lose weight. Really? Now, does ice make you lose weight? Now, hi everyone. Long time no see. So my family and I traveled to Tokyo and toured the whole Taiwan in June and the first half of July, and we had a fabulous time. And certainly, we ate a lot of good food, and I gained back a little bit of weight. <clears throat> so I saw this、um, trendy topic of the ice diet that can promote weight loss because it requires the body to heat up the ice and ice water. Uh, to body temperature before it can be absorbed, so the whole process uses more energy and burns calories、uh, and promote weight loss. Well, that sounds quite legitimate, but is it supported by evidence? Now, first, ice is just water and it has no calories. Now, the coldest ice in a regular consumer's freezer at home is at negative twenty degrees Celsius. And、according to an article published in the Annals of Internal Medicine in 2010, if one were to ingest one liter of ice, it would first have to be warmed from negative 20 degrees Celsius to zero degrees Celsius, which would require 20 calories of energy, or、uh, 20 kcal or 20 dietary calorie. Now that it takes another 80 calories. To melt ice at zero degrees Celsius to water at zero degrees Celsius, and finally the water at zero degrees Celsius must be warmed to thirty-seven degrees Celsius or the normal body temperature before absorption. But the whole process of eating one liter of ice would burn approximately. One hundred and forty calories, but because the body's metabolism is not completely efficient, it would use about ten to twenty percent more energy to complete the process. So it would take about one hundred and sixty calories total. Now that's the same amount of energy burned in running one mile. Well, that sounds awesome, right? But it is also a lot of ice. And that is equivalent to about three cans of soda can. Well, now remember, it needs to be icy cold ice. Also, now according to、um, the ice、uh, water weight loss hack, a glass of water, maybe eight ounces or so, or two hundred and thirty-six milliliter of icy water before bed, would require about. Thirty-five additional calories for the body to absorb properly. So, to give you the perspective,、uh, that is equal to doing five minutes of moderately intense aerobic exercise, such as elliptical machine, stair machine, and four lunges. Well, that sounds. Not too bad, right? Now, from my perspective, eating ice and drinking、uh, ice water a few times a day has no major harm to the body. But be aware that chewing a lot of ice can cause stress to the teeth and potentially crack enamel. And drinking a whole glass of water right before bed could be a little disturbing, in my opinion, especially during the middle of. The night, with the need to go to the bathroom. So I would not recommend that routine if you are someone with trouble sleeping. Now moving on to the second part of this ice hack, the alpaline. Now I'm not going to include the link to that specific product to avoid an intentional product promotion, but you can find out very easily with a quick search on the internet. Now according to its product label, this This alpaline supplement is a blend of vitamin B12, chromium, a blend of six different herbal extracts from drumstick tree leaf, bigarate orange, turmeric,、uh, rhizome, deca nut, golden algae, and ginger rhizome. Now, while all of the herbal extracts have some evidence of supporting health in one way or the other. The question is if these herbal extracts make people burn more calories or make them eat less. Well, interestingly, the supplement company listed all the ingredients 
could help maintain inner body temperature. Now, that is a very tricky term. And they cited a paper published in the International uh, Journal of Obesity in 2019 stating that low inner body temperature is a real cause of belly fat. Now, is that true? Let's look at the paper. Now, this paper did find a significant association between body temperature and obesity markers in men and postmenopausal women. Now, however, no associations was found in premenopausal women, and the paper actually found that body temperature increases with weight, not decreases. So it contradicts the supplement claim that raising your inner body temperature could activate the fat burning process. Now remember, although each ingredient has some small studies, there's no evidence directly saying that when combined, they work as the product claims. So the natural ingredients also have some side effects that you must be aware of. Now first, there is no reliable data on golden algae or drumstick tree leaf. Then moving on to deca nut or African mango seed can actually cause diarrhea and low blood sugar levels. Now watch out for the blood sugar carefully if someone uses diabetes drugs and uses deca nut products at the same time. Now third, this one is a real issue, which is called the bigorate orange. It's also known as bitter orange, which is a citrix native to Asia that contains an active ingredient called uh, synephrine that is similar to ephedra. Now, in 2004, the FDA banned ephedra due to serious side effects on the heart. And since then, many weight loss and bodybuilding products have used bitter orange and caffeine in its place. And bitter orange contains many chemicals that affect the nervous systems and the cardiovascular system as well. That may also increase blood pressure and cause trouble in sleeping. In fact, the main active ingredient in bitter orange, the synephrine, uh, is considered a banned substance by the National Collegiate Athlete Association, or the NCAA. So if you are an athlete taking products containing traces of bitter orange, such as the alpaline, it may get you banned from competitions. Remember that. Now, the only two substances in alpaline that are known to be safe as supplements are ginger and turmeric. Now, there are many health studies on these two ingredients that need a different video to cover. But in short, the specific benefit in promoting weight loss does not appear to be clinically significant at this time. So now you ask me, does ice hack or anything about temperature work on promoting weight loss? Now, there's actually a study in that regard. Uh, the question is, how does temperature affect body fat and metabolism? And what does uh, work to support weight loss without adding an extra workout sections, right? Now, turn out that, uh, you know, if you turn down the thermostat and sleep at a cool temperature, could help. Now, it turns out that humans have several types of fat. White fat stores extra energy, and that's something we want to get rid of. Too much White fat is a characteristic of obesity and increases the risk of type 2 diabetes and other diseases. Uh, in contrast, brown fat right, burns chemical energy to create heat and help maintain body temperature. In a 2014 small study led by researchers from the Virginia Commonwealth University or VCU showed that young, healthy men sleeping at 66 degrees Fahrenheit, or at about 19 degrees Celsius each night for a month, led to a 42% increase in brown fat and a 10% increase in fat metabolism activities and improved insulin sensitivity. Now, so it appears to help a little bit. Now, let's conclude that the, what we find or what we know about this ice hack weight loss trend. Now, first, eating ice and drinking icy cold water can increase calorie use. 
and it is best to spread throughout the day to avoid midnight bathroom trips. If you don't have good teeth, don't chew a lot of ice. They are best to supplement other weight loss regimens. Now, in terms of the alpine supplement, I would have to say the evidence is a little bit more doubtful. And remember, just a product claim it is all natural does not mean it has no side effect. Remember that. Now, I don't suggest you setting your thermostat to so low, sixty six degrees. Uh, on a hot summer day, because it is not very energy efficient, and we all know energy prices are pretty high these days. But it is certainly more doable to not crank up the heat during the winter, in my opinion. Well, you may try that in the upcoming winter seasons、uh, in the northern hemisphere, and if you are in the southern hemisphere, you may try that right now, right? Now, anyhow,、um, so. If it's this your first time here,、uh, I'm Dr. Hon, an assistant professor of pharmaceutical sciences at Notre Dame Maryland University School of Pharmacy, and this channel covers health tips with a goal to help you live a healthier life. So thank you very much for watching, and hope to see you again next time. Thank you. Take care. Bye.